My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Hey everyone. We are still getting the great cars in here. I just bought three Mustangs from a Mustang collector out in Nebraska, this being one of them. A genuine documented Mach 1. It's an S-Code 390 four-speed car. Go to volocars.com. That's where you get all the specs, pricing, information on this car and a few hundred other collector cars that are all for sale at volocars.com. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the little bell icon and you'll be notified every time we post a new video of an exciting car like this one right here. Uh, but before you do all that, join me. Let's go for a spin. Very nicely restored car. It's better than just a driver. It's below concourse. It's just right in there. Real nice, respectable car. Um, the body, I think, is, is excellent. It was repainted a couple years ago. Everything fits really nice. It's straight. It's smooth. I like all the gaps. It's all metal. Bottom of the door is clean. There's no bubbles, no issues around here. Both sides are the same way. It's all nice. I didn't notice any problem areas, no cracking. Again, no bubbles, nothing like that. Trunk lid, nice and square. Fits real good. All new decals. The chrome back here looks new. The bumper, the reverse lights, the pop-up gas cap, these marker lights, that all looks new. The trim around the windows is very good. It's shiny. I can't call it new. There might be a little tiny dink or scuff. Um, these look like they're new. Door handles are new. It has the sport mirrors. Uh, it's got the blackout hood treatment with hood pins. Of course, the hood scoop with the turn signals in the back. Uh, windshield is excellent. Uh, it's got the chrome wheels. They're in very nice shape. Not brand new, but they're really nice. The BF Goodrich tires have hardly any miles on them. Uh, the trim looks new. The grille is excellent. The bumper is worn. Actually, there's a little spot of chrome missing right there. So the bumper is a, li a little bit worn. You don't have to replace it immediately, but they're cheap enough. That's something uh, you, know, you could do eventually. Uh, antenna looks good, new uh, fuzzy window seals, the weather strips have been replaced, door jams are painted up real nice, it's a deluxe interior with the high back seats with the red inserts, new carpets with the red sewn in floor mats, the front seats are reupholstered, the dash pad is new, it's not a plastic glue on cap, it's an actual dash pad. This door panel is in very nice shape. It has a little cracking right here in the armrest. Underneath the car is real clean. It's all metal. Uh, someone cleaned it up and they sprayed it with the red oxide primer. So it's better than most, but not concourse. They didn't do every little nut and bolt under there, uh, but it's cleaned up real respectable. Uh, inside the trunk, it's all sprayed with the gray and white spatter finish. Bottom of the trunk lid's glossy has new weather strip. I think this quarter was fully replaced. It's perfectly clean metal. The other quarter still has that factory uh, like undercoat on the inside of it. So it has the center console. Uh, it has an AM FM radio. I noticed the clock was actually working. This door panel is in really nice shape. Sill plates are real nice. Headliner looks like it's replaced. Has a few little wrinkles back here and the sides. But overall, the interior, uh, like the rest of the car, is very, very nice. Can't use the word perfect, but uh, it is very good. I do have the Marty report. Uh, this is a you know a genuine Mach 1 S Code 394 speed car, and this is the factory color called Winter Blue. The metal flake is laid out real nice and even, and the clear coat's real glossy. It's a nice glossy, wet-looking car. The metal engine bay is all really nice. The spot welds and seams look really good to me. It's painted a semi-gloss black. The motor has a nice Ford blue paint job on it. The chrome air cleaner and valve covers look new. 
We'll fire it up for you. The motor was rebuilt by the previous owner about 10 years ago and rarely driven. I was told that a couple, two, 3,000 miles, if that, is on the motor. The four-speed close ratio trans was just completely rebuilt. It has its original 323 traction lock rear end. It has a brand new Flowmaster exhaust system. The brakes, suspension has been checked out. That's all in really good shape. A new clutch and pressure plate and all of that uh, as well when they did the trans. Looks like the interior lights work. Runs real good. The AM FM radio does work by the way, I just tried that. It has power disc brakes and all the components look really good. The distributor, the wires, coil, fuel pump, alternator all look fresh. It has the reproduction hoses and clamps, it has the fan shroud, the Ford washer bottle, bottom of the hoods painted blue, it has cadmium plated fender bolts. Uh, the original buck tag is still attached. That gives information about the car. The VIN numbers on there, different option codes. Yeah, the motor's smooth as can be up here. Hood fits real nice. It makes that nice muscle car sound out the back as the right splitter tips. Very respectable car, real nice. I'm happy with this car. So visit volocars.com. Plenty of ways on there to contact our staff. Uh, they'll walk you through the whole car, answer any questions you have. Plenty of ways to get the car delivered, financing, send you more pictures, videos, uh, whatever we can help you with. Subscribe to the YouTube channel and click on the bell icon. That way you're notified as these cars come out. Thanks for watching.